Woo! Welcome back, everybody. Glad you're here. Um, this is just a video for, of me wanting to thank all of you out there for the support on this channel. Um, I started this channel a year ago, and when I started it, um, it was kind of like a rough part of my life. It wasn't insanely bad, but I had just lost my job. I was job hunting. Um, my days were kind of dragging me down. I wasn't in a really good place. And my wife pushed me to start this channel. She's like, you're perfect for this. This is what you need to do. Go ahead and do it. I'm like, what am I going to do? She's like, react to stuff. You got such a big mouth. You've got opinions on everything. Just react to stuff. Okay. I've always wanted kind of in the back of my head, wanted to start a channel or, or have some kind of a show or a podcast or something talking about music you've never heard of. Um, because I grew up listening to music that a lot of people had never heard of. I was, uh, when a bunch of my friends were headbangers, um, I was somehow able to grab a hold of a lot of music that was coming out of Europe and even Japan at the time. And I've just always been fascinated in finding music that wasn't mainstream in America. So listening to uh, BBC Top 40 was always interesting, but I've never, but I don't really, I, if you know me at all, if you've watched any of my, I don't like pop that much. Um, I just, especially today, I think everything on the radio is 90% garbage. Um, and just, it's so formulaic and commercialized. I just, I go out and I try to find like the unique stuff. I want to find, I want to find like the talent, the stuff that just blows my mind. I don't care about the genre. Uh, if you've been on here, you know I've done country, I've done Christian metal, I've done pop, I've done, you know, everything in between, pretty much. And some of it has been really popular, when, uh, and a lot of it has been um, little-known artists that not, don't get a lot of views. But I've never, I was never really about the views. I was like, okay, if I can start this channel in one year, if I have a thousand subs. I'll, I'll be able to monetize it and maybe I can make like a few bucks on it, you know, like a side hustle kind of thing. Um, so on May 12th of 2022, I set out this video. This is my very first one. If you haven't seen it. It's only got like about 800 views. So not a lot of people have seen it. Uh, it's rough. It's, you can tell it's my first one. Uh, I didn't really have the concept. I was still building it and I had to learn a lot. So I put up this one, which was a review of uh, Faka Ur by Loam. And um, learned real quick that if I'm going to do foreign language, I need to get a hold of lyrics so I can translate so I know what I'm talking about. And I talk about this music, when I talk about the bars, when I talk about stuff like that. Because that was, if, if you know what that Faka Ur means, uh, it did not translate unprofanely <laughs> so i learned real quick i left the video up because it was a learning exercise and that was actually the official launch of my station i didn't do anything for like two more weeks i started doing a ton of research how to make the videos how to put them up how to get feeds how to do our analytics and la -di -da -di -da. Oh, that's background stuff that i'm still learning and then uh it was a couple months later and uh so i started in may may 12th and then in like uh i somewhere in there um i did a bts video and it did awesome and it kicked me up by by august i was over a thousand subs and i was monetized and actually made like about a hundred bucks like in september holy cow okay i'm like ahead of the curve and then I didn't make any more money until like from February of this year or something like that, January. And I uh, made a couple more bucks because you get paid out when you, when you do this stuff, you get paid out. Once you reach a hundred dollars, then they'll send you a check. They're not sending you a check for 20 bucks. They're not sending you a check for 28 cents. If that's all you made. So, so three, four months later, I earned another hundred dollars. They sent me another check and all the whole, whole time I'm, I'm learning it and just, trying to build a base of like what I wanted the channel to be to find music that had that, that most 
because I'm an American living in Florida, most Americans hadn't heard, but I go out and I find all this music in Japan and in South Korea and in Russia and in, in England and in, and in the heartland of America. Like I'm just finding this music all over the place and bringing it in. And some of it just goes crazy with it. When I put people like uh, Dimash or uh, Diana Akadanova or, um, you know, BTS or anything like that. Like it just, it, it brings people in and people are like, Hey, I love your channel. I sub to your channel. And I'm like, Oh, cool. But at the same time, I'm also going out and like finding these little people and, or these little known artists that hardly have any views. And I'm trying to put them on there to like expose people so that they, if they come back or if they're, if they're sub, they're on the feed, they can find these people too. And maybe they'll, and maybe they'll be attracted to them, share that. And kind of like create like little, you know, spore explosions, you know, and have like these and have these unknown artists like kind of develop into bigger artists, maybe just through word of mouth or if my channel has anything to do with it. Fantastic. And I've made some mistakes along the way. Uh, if you saw my video on Blackpink, uh, that was that taught me a lot. <laughs> I, I, I had a. A lot of vicious responses to that because I was probably a little bit harsh on them. Um, so I had to learn. So I had to take my lumps along the way. But came up to the beginning of this month, and I'm like, oh my 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 uh, anniversary's coming up sometime. When exactly sure the date, and so I went and I was like looking at my channel analytics. Goodness, like. I'm close to 5,000. Like, if I hit 5,000 before one year, like, that's just insane. Like, that was never on my radar. But slowly and surely, like, the subs just kept climbing and climbing and climbing. And I gain 1,000 and lose 100 and up and down thing. And uh, so two weeks ago, I put, I, I, well, actually, last week, I, I was, uh, I knew that, my anniversary was on Friday, and I was like 50 away. And I'm like, oh, if I can grab 50, 50 subs, like that would just be cool. Like I don't need to do it. I don't, I want to do it. Have 5,000 on the 12th would be cool. And, um, but, it, but it wasn't like anything crazy. And uh, so I put up the video of Morissette, uh, a, a singer I had no clue even existed, uh, a Filipino uh, a Filipina, um, which I hadn't done any music from there. So that was really cool. And she just blew me away. So I posted it and, uh, because it was, it was, it was, a, it was a suggestion in the comment box, but from, uh, Anima Chains, Beast Anima. Thank you. Uh, I see your other stuff, man. I'm getting to you. <laughs> and, uh, <clears throat> so I put it up there and just kind of let it go. And, and I, and I only work on like Mondays and Tuesdays. I come in and Monday night, Tuesday night, I'll, I'll do whatever I'm doing that week and post it up. Maybe one video, maybe two. Usually I try to do at least two, sometimes three or four get out there. Just whatever happens to flow that week. And uh, so I put that one up and I put another one up. I put up, I um, can't remember what the other one I put up this week was. I think it was... Um, Oh, music travel love was the other one I put up, and uh, and it was smaller, huge channel, four and a half million subscribers, and I was like, well, maybe I'll get some traffic out of there, and um, and then I posted more sets and just kind of and and just kind of like glanced at it, and it kept creeping up, and it was like moving up like ten a day, twelve a day, and Thursday morning, so so Friday is the one year anniversary, Thursday morning. I'm looking at it and I'm like 25 away or something like that. I'm like, well, I might hit it. I might not. Maybe I'll hit it on the 12th. That'd be cool. And then got busy with my day or whatever. And that night, like about 10 o'clock, I looked and I'm at like 5,050. Like it just shot up. What happened? And Morris said just which had kind of like just brought in a couple of views, all of a sudden just took off. Like you guys were recommending it or subbing it or whatever. Well, no, you were subbing, but you were sharing it or whatever was going on. And all of a sudden it caught, it caught on. And now I'm sitting at like 5,100 
50, 51, 59 subscribers. And I hit it all literally 365 days after I started this channel. And I can't tell you how thankful I am to you guys for this. Um, this is not something I do for the money, obviously. Um, it's something I do as kind of an outlet and there's a lot more I want to do. And I'm still learning about doing stuff. I, I want to do like live chats. I want to do some gaming. I want to do like this and that. And, and no, knowing that people out there want to see your stuff, um, drives you. It's a real morale boost. And with the month I've been having, this came at like the perfect time. It's just been a crazy last couple of weeks. And, uh, a lot of stuff was not going my way at all. And for you guys to do this was just awesome. All you Morissette fans that have jumped on recently, I got another one coming for you as a thank you. When I hit a thousand subs with BTS, I immediately did another BTS video for all the uh, BTS fans out there. <clears throat> and so I'm definitely going to do one for you Morissette fans because you guys definitely put me over the top and I really appreciate it. So thank you very much. Um, I just want to keep doing what I can to expose people to new music, to drive conversation, to open people's eyes to a much bigger world out there than what we're used to. You know, It's very easy to get isolated. And the artists that I've found, um, like I've run across Russian artists that I had no idea existed. If you go back and look at my and look at my channel, uh, there's a band named Kino that was massively influential in Cold War Russia. And of course, when they're sitting behind the Iron Curtain, you know, we had no idea they existed. I, I had no idea that was a band. And then, and then I was reading some article and it was like one of their songs was considered like the best song to come out of like Russian rock and roll in the 20th century. I'm like, how have I never heard about the greatest Russian rock and roll song of the 20th century? And going down that rabbit hole has just been a trip. And finding other bands and, and drawing in fans from Russia who are like, oh man, I subbed to your channel and now I found this guy and hey, you need to go check out this person. And, you know, and I have fans from South Korea coming in. Now I got fans from Philippines coming in and just, and, and creating this global community right here on my channel just blows my mind beyond belief. It's just amazing. So I just want to thank all of you for it. I want to thank uh, my wife for pushing me to do this. I want to thank God for giving me some kind of a talent to do something like this and allowing me to do this at all. I probably should have started this years ago, and, uh, but I'm glad I have done it now. And I just want to thank all of you from the bottom of my heart for the success here. Uh, hopefully a year from now, I'll have a hundred million. I'll be on like Mr. Beast level. I'll have like one of those plaques in back, you know, <laughs> but in the meantime, I'm just going to be going out there and finding new music and trying to post the best stuff that I can. And I hope you guys come along for the ride. And if you, uh, like, like I always say, if you have any suggestions, I want to hear them. Please comment below and, and, and let me know what you're listening to in your little corner of the world that you think the rest of the world might want to hear. Because I know it's a small channel, but one day it may be big and you never know what will take off. So... Again, thank you. Hope you stick around. Do me a favor and share this channel with your friends or with complete strangers. And uh, I hope I'll see you back here. In the meantime, y'all be good. Y'all be safe. And I love you very, very much. Thank you. Bye.